Dave McCowan, IFBB professional athlete, and today I'm going to show you a few leg exercises. They're pretty concentrated. I'm using bands. You can do them anywhere. You can do them in the gym. You can supplement what you're already doing in the gym, um, or you can just set them aside and start all over and try these new moves. They're pretty specific, not big movements, but no hip extension or movement from the hip should be a big move. So let me show you. Make sure the uh, the handle is secure and behind you. You don't want it flipping and hitting you in the face. That could hurt. So I'm, I'm using tension holding this hand, whatever hand you'd like. You can wrap it around a piece of equipment, but I like having as much control as possible. So it's just a slight movement from about three or four inches back. You can angle your leg hitting your glutes from different angles. Now, I'm gonna do a single leg hamstring curl in the same position, which is convenient. Right there. And you add resistance by pulling the band or doing a, more, um, a band that has more tension, so it's more difficult. In this next exercise, I'm going to be working my outside of my glutes, so it adds a nice roundness. You'll see people on the uh, hip abduction machine where they put their legs out. This is similar, but I can create the, my own resistance with the bands. So I wrap it around my knees, make sure there's a little room for movement. Lay on the side. You keep your feet together. Actually, let me get that band. You know, it takes a second. You gotta finagle it here. You also have to see what tension's gonna work so you can get the rep range you want. So if it's too tight, you can only do like three or four, it's no good, so. There. And you wanna keep constant tension with the bands. So if I close my knees, then I lose that tension. So I'm I'm keeping constant tension, makes it nice, nice and difficult. Whew. It looks easy and it's not. And then you go to the other side and you do the same amount of reps on both sides. Next exercise is going to be a glute bridge. On this exercise, I use two bands to um, add more resistance and create more tension. So I just doubled it up and put one around on this side and I'm holding it with both hands. Same thing on the other side, so I just did it in opposite directions. Put it around the actual glutes because that's where the resistance has to be because that's where I'm lifting from. Shoulders are back on the floor. Pulling and squeeze up and lower. Back up. You can have your feet shoulder width apart. It's a little easier for a little more difficulty. Put your feet right together and hold it. You can even hold it like this isometrically and time it. It's a killer. It burns. And you can like rep it out. You can even put one leg up and do single leg. Just like that switch. And that's it. On this exercise, I'm doing squats. I find that it gives me a little bit more balance and stability to use a band as opposed to just with no resistance at all. Um, and putting your arms out is especially good if you're beginning. Because you're sitting back but this has more resistance going forward so I don't fall back on the, on the ground. Or you can go right here. If you're a little bit intermediate, more advanced. But I find this, I, I think this is a little bit better. It's better to have good balance and it gives you better form. Works the shoulders too. Thank 
you for joining me in my seven part series, the second half of Real Strength, seen exclusively on fitnessrxwomen.com. Thanks, Fitness Rx Women, for showcasing my tips and tricks. You know, things here and there that I like to share with everyone. Um, now let's say that you're thinking, mm, I want to take my fitness to the next level. Come see me. My website is avacowan.com. You can email me at ava at avacowan.com. And I'll get right back to you. And I write customized programs made just for you. Now let's just say that you're thinking this woman is incredible. And I have to give her a huge endorsement or sponsorship opportunity, a guest appearance. Anything of that nature, well, I manage exclusively by Fitness Management Group. You can contact them as well. Um, so I look forward to hearing from you. If you need to get a hold of me, do so. And until next time, thank you. Keep believing.